Culo, Mexico, the same town Ring the bell. that my man Tito Santana hails from, Tacula, Mexico. Lobos, let's see. Jose Acosta coming in aggressive. Lobos has really done a couple little things lately that have guarded the respect of most of the talent roster. Let's see if Jose Acosta got that memo. Nope. He must have the memo because he's really being aggressive with Lobos here. He's not taking any chances as to look stupid out there as the PPW Heavyweight Champion. But that little Lobos has had hard up to this point. When you're young and green in the industry, you're trying to make a name for yourself. You take these matches. You take any match you can get to get on a wrestling card. That's why half the guys here are respecting Lobos. But look at it cost. As soon as he gets in trouble, he pulls the back of the mask and Lobos into the corner. Lobos is taking a bunch of shots to stay inside the corner. Oh, man. He dropped him like a bad habit. And a cover. He's not going to get him. Oh, but it was closer than I thought it would be. God bless Lobo. So able to kick out. And the ring technician that Acosta is goes right back to that softened up left arm. Lobo's hanging tough at this point. Pressure on the elbow. Pressure on the shoulder. He's got a hold of that wrist. So the entire arm is covered. Lobos who is outweighed by 35 to 40 pounds, 30 pounds let's say, trying to get away to get to the ropes to break that hold and stay alive and everybody in this building wants to see it. Oh, but that cost a, God forbid the man breaks green, even with a green kid. But that's what Lobo signed on for when he wanted to start wrestling training. Oh, but this time he goes up and over on Acosta, and he snatches a schoolboy, but not even for a one count. Oh, and Acosta up like, wow, nothing. He was up like lightning there. And that clothesline. Pull the elbows in one hell of a precarious position. I hope I said that right, folks. If not, comment, let me know. Don't forget, folks, Premier Pro Wrestling on Patreon. Premier Pro Wrestling, Pro Wrestling Tees. And Lobos has fired the champ up against the ropes. That is a feat in itself at this stage of the game, but reversed by Acosta. And Acosta with those creative legs and feet, man. Takes Lobos out of the equation. A lot of time went by. I think he's gonna kick out, and he kicked out like he meant it. God bless him, he's hanging tough so far. He's living with the world champ. And for those of you that don't know, Acosta, this is a legitimate. He's probably within the top two dozen wrestlers in the sport today anywhere in the world one two now you know how Acosta hooked the leg that time he would never admit it but that hooking of the leg showing that he's really starting to respect Los Lobos hammerlock nope Lobos is getting his medal tested and look at him hanging in there, literally reaching out to the fans for support to get some sort of positive energy flowing in here. And look at him, man, it's working. He's feeding off him. He's feeding off him. He got out of the hold. Oh, look at him go to town on Acosta's midsection and chest. He may have knocked the wind out of Jose and He's really putting those shoulders in with authority. God bless the little guy. Backs him in, but too much time has passed. Oh, Acosta with the elbow, floats right over. There's one. There's two. And let's see if he gets that third amigo. And yeah, this one's a standing one. He used to call this in a, tri a tribute to Eddie, but now he thinks he does it better than Eddie Guerrero did it. But why is he taking so much time to go for the cover? And here we go back to the cocky cover. He really thinks, oh, that might have been it. That might have been it. Be honest, wouldn't you just love it if the little guy could pull some sort of miracle out of his butt? And here we go. I have to admit it, I am a mark for the short arm scissor. 
What an undeniably tough hold. How do you get out of it? Look at the little guy, Lobo said so. And let's see, he gets the shoulder, finally he worked for it. Acosta hangs on and brings it back down right at the count of one. Five minutes gone in the match, five minutes remain. Acosta is getting bored. Oh, look at the punishment, I couldn't see it from this angle. Lobos is earning it out there, just staying alive here. I'm surprised he hasn't tapped out yet, but look at the little guy. He's trying to get out of there. Costa has put that thigh in the head, but look at that. Lobos made it to the ropes. That little guy has got some fortitude. But he can't follow up. At least he's out of harm's way and stays alive. Knee to the ribs. Another knee to the other side of the rib cage, and that's what they call disseminating. That's what he's doing to the torso of Lobos, and this is just punishment, pure punishment. Oh, 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 I think that was, is it better to be lucky or better to be good? Because right there there was some luck involved. <laughs> he just toppled over and Acosta effed himself. Here we go, little guy. Oh, man, there's one drop kick. Oh, he ducks Acosta. He rolls him in. No, I can't believe he's gotten the counter roll. Acosta Prip kicks out. And there's the inside Crano. He got one and a half. And here he comes off the ropes. Leapfrogs Acosta. Comes off the other side. Oh! And Acosta. One, two, three. This opening contest, Jose Acosta.